Good morning. It's Sunday morning. <laughs> it's 2024. It's the year of get rid of the Tories. It's the year of get rid of Rishi Sunak and a stinking, rotten, lying, cheating, corrupt, incompetent Tory government. Who's had enough? We've all had enough, Chucky. He says, uh, Adam Baikonoff, look, there's a squatter holed up in number 10. He uh, says, uh, Rishi Sunak's refusing to hold a general election this spring means that the voters will have had five years, five years since the last general election. And there's been three occupants. None of which, they ain't, they've got no, no, only one of them had any kind of electoral mandate from the public. Rishi Sunak, he, he, <laughs> he lost to a lettuce and he's still in, holding up. Oh, Rishi Sunak, he's coming in. I'll cut tax, I'll cut welfare, I'll cut tax by curbing welfare. Smash the poor. And look, this is someone saying like, this is another reason why there's going to be an election in spring because the COVID inquiry is coming out. And they're going to hold the government to account. They're going to hold their feet to the fire. They're going to come down them like a ton of bricks. <laughs> no, they're not. These inquiry. What, another inquiry? Says the exclusives, the budget, um, bankruptcies. Oh, this is the thing about the councils. They're saying, sell it all. They're saying, not just sell off the family silver. Sell everything. Everything must go. Sell the country. Richard Sunak says he'll cut taxes. He's, that is disgusting, isn't it? He's going to smash the poor to give inheritance tax to the top, what is it, 1% or 4%. Get rid of the Tories, 2024. 